obviously Drew Brees has, has been in the news the last couple of days for for what he said and and Vic Fangio had some comments saying he hasn't seen um, racism in the NFL, which he apologized for and sort of walked back today. I'm, I'm wondering if you could speak on, from, from a league perspective, uh, what you think um, the league is doing or, or how the league is doing in terms of um, having African-American coaches and, and people in power. And obviously the numbers indicate that that's sort of an issue. Just, just how you think the league is addressing that? Um, I think they're trying to address it. I think they're talking about it. Um, and I saw what Vic said and I saw him apologize for it. And um, it's tough because you don't, white people don't feel it. There's like, you're not going to think that person's racist. And, but you know what? How the heck are there four, only four black coaches out of 32 head coaches? How are there only two GMs? I mean, we're in a predominantly, I mean, the majority of our players are black. So the fact that there's that few, I mean, that's not debatable. Like, I don't know if people are openly thinking they're doing it, which I think the people sort to that. But that, that's what the problem is. I mean, that number is not debatable. And, and, and that's, that is an issue. And I think we talk about it a lot. Um, and it is something that has to get better. I, I know they've thrown out a bunch of stuff. I know I only speak for myself. I, I, I try to, you know, I try to hire people that I work with that are prepared for it. And fortunately, that's worked out well for me. I've got, we got a Muslim coach. We got a, a, I mean, a Muslim coordinator. We got a black coordinator. Um, we have a lesbian on our staff. Uh, we have a, we have everything, and it's not just to show people that we're trying to be diverse. It's just because I've been around these people, and, and they are really good at what they do. And I can't, we can't win without these people, and, and that's just how it works out. I don't know why the numbers aren't like that, but the numbers are are wrong, and that's stuff that hell yeah we want to fix, but it's it's not an easy answer. It's continuing to talk, continuing to the whole thing with society, everything. It's all, it's all very similar on different levels. And that's why those numbers don't lie. That's what makes it a fact. And that's what white people have to admit.